and we're gonna start going through that right now. See if we can find some more good stuff. Oh, okay, there's a handbag. This one's got some weight. It's got some stuff. And there's the stuff. Yeah. Oh, oh, got some got some money. We got some money. What's this? Oh guys, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Everyone's always complaining about my nails after doing a locker. I don't know. I think they look fabulous, actually. Fabulous. Charm pendant. Oh, Swarovski. Uh oh. I don't. What do you do? I don't think this. I don't think this is good. There's only one way to find out. I shouldn't do this. I shouldn't do this. Okay. Very nice. That's a nice bag. Oh, how funny. I was just talking to Jen on the phone. I said, I haven't found any more Michael Kors purses. <laughs> and then I did. Dooney and Burke, what the heck? Guess who's back? Back again. Locking up his back. Tell a friend to watch this video. All right, <laughs> share, share, share the video, and uh, show others what we're gonna find in here. Cause you know what, there's gonna be so many treasures in here. Just kidding, I don't know that. I did uh, clear out a lot of the clothes that were right here. There's lots of garbage bags of clothes. I grabbed those, went through them very quick, and threw them in my trailer. Cause yesterday, I just need to maximize my time. This morning, I'm not sure if I said it or not, but they had a staff meeting. So it's like after one o'clock, maybe 1:30 right now. It's a very late start, but. Uh, um, as soon as they called me and said we're back in the office, boom, I was on the road, got down here. So um, I only have like four and a half hours. I know that's a lot of time, but I go slow. Filming takes a long time. All right, so let's get on to where we left off. This is already processed. This is that bag where we found the change, and we're going to start going through that right now. See if we can find some more good stuff. Man, I wore my wrong shoes today. That sucks. I like wearing my boots to work. So we get messed up, it's not a big deal, but um, <laughs> I forgot the boots at home. So these, I kind of like them. This is out of one of those recent lockers. That's from where I found the master replicas and the showcase collection, sideshow collection, all those really high collectibles. Um, I did find a pair of shoes that fit me, and I like them. I don't want to ruin them. There's a little bit more change. Yeah, that's nice. Some sort of a stone right here, or glass or something. Polished up, nice. Little bracelet. Sisters, <laughs> little miniatures, little refrigerator magnet. There, six bucks for that. My goodness, what the what is that? Some kind of plant has been burned at the tip. There's another glass piece right there, a little elephant. Is it glass or a stone? I'm not sure. Okay. I think that's it for that one. It's hard to say. It's so much stuff in there. Disposable placemats. Little pouch right here. Ooh, what do we got here? Some glasses. Eternally. Lay specs. Those feel kind of nice, actually. They're blue light specs. Okay. For the computer and such. Actually, Grace wears those. I'm not sure why. I'll bring them home and see if she wants them. Cheaper ones is scuffed up. What's this? Uh oh. What have we got here? Oh, a little cannon. Power shot digital elf, 8 megapixel. Okay. Not bad. We want really 10 megapixels or higher. Got a data card in there. Let's see how big that is. 4 gigabytes. Okay. It's not super small. It's alright. Okay. That's a good find. I think that was for really a phone. It's got little suction cups. I've never seen that before. Suction that on. There's a good charger there. It's got a play button with the channel. I'm not sure what that is. Just wireless, it says. Double USB. Okay, well, anyways, we'll put it in electronics a lot. There's a skull. Found human skull in locker. Oh! I've kept a couple of the pens I found before, and one of them leaked all over my hands, and here we are two days later. No. One day later, <laughs> I still got ink on my hands. I've been scrubbing them. They don't come off very easy. Hmm. I think that's a wireless charger right there. Needless to say, that is not silver because it's sticking to these magnets right there. <laughs> oh, that's gross. Look at that. Ow. Oh, it's a bunch of little fingers. 
Everyone's always complaining about my nails after doing a locker. I don't know. I think they look fabulous, actually. Fabulous. Oh, that's nice. It's got the USB-C on there. Power plug. That's I'm probably going to keep that one. I don't have enough of those. Oh, guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Five bucks just sitting there. What the heck? We already found a dollar right before I left last time. And now we found five bucks, what the heck? Ooh, and there's a power bar or something right there. Gross. <laughs> Some glass beads, bracelet, dice. Another good pen right there. I like it. Mm, I like these too. These are little short paintbrushes. Tight spot paintbrush. That's a nice paintbrush. Gosh, I must sound like such a hoarder. Hey, that's kind of nice. What's that for? Is that for clipping onto your phone oh it doesn't fit on my GoPro oh <gasps> maybe I can clip it on my chest harness hmm maybe that helps I don't see really anything else interesting in here I'll go through it more carefully but I think that's gonna be it I'll let you guys know if I find something good I'll take measure okay this uh, when I was pulling the clothes out fell down which is why I moved it since last night and of course I had to peek in it because Gianna spotted this box and she's like oh can you bring that home and I'm like sure but I, I peeked in it it's not in here it's not in here unfortunately oh that's nice right there I like finding these not only do we use them all the time in my garage for organizing lots and stuff but here when I have like that bag right before we could have dumped it in there I'll, I'll show you guys if we uh, find another bin that needs to, bag needs to be gone through it's another very nice Welcome mat right there. Well, this one's for the art supplies. It's a nice paint right there. Oh, geez. <laughs> Bummer, got the instruction book. It's not the vacuum. Painted all over their books. That's a nice brush right there. Was that for a toilet? I don't want to touch that if it's for a toilet, but... I'll go to the market. Okay, let's grab this one. Oh, okay, there's a handbag. That's a good start. Um, also, this is a good little plush right here. That's a tie. Beanie Booze. Beanie Booze. That's nice. Okay, we'll put that in... There it is. I'm going to put that in my keeper bin. Okay, well, that's got stuff in it, too. Nice. All right, this thing right here is, I think, one of those clamps on the door doorway and it hangs uh you let your your baby bounce around in it and this is a baby pack right for carrying them what's this lisa lane new york oh, that's a nice bag is that like a diaper bag or liz lang liz lang i don't know if that's a diaper bag <laughs> well there's a baby powder so maybe it is i don't know there's hand sanitizer another sign it's got a little scuff right there i'm just gonna bring the stock in wild little crafting stuff here what else we got here patchy Ooh, dark chocolate 80 percent cocoa uh oh guys i'm thinking a locker food challenge yes i'm on a diet no i shouldn't have that yes i will probably do it anyways for the cause for the cause. A little paperwork. Oh, that's another bag. Okay. Baby owner's manual. <laughs> Here's some cards, guys. Here's some cards. Come on. Let's find. Oh, that's a brand new card right there. Keeper box. No, I got a bin somewhere for the family photos. We'll get them back their photos. We'll bring it to the office. Okay, let's see what we got here. Yeah, some tampons and a pen. Dubai. <laughs> That's funny. Let's see what's in this one. I think nothing. Let's just make sure. Yep, nothing. This one's got some wear on the bottom here. Just bring it to the market. Market. Okay, let's see about this one right here. This one's got some weight. It's got some stuff. And there's the stuff. Yeah. Oh, oh, got some, got some money. We got some money. What's this? Oops, okay, don't show it. There's her business cards inside. This is a nice little business card holder. 
And there's some, uh, wait, romantic, antibacterial, but what's it romantic about antibacterial, you know, I don't know. <laughs> it's a nice little, let's see, I think it's a mirror, let's see, yep. What's up, Vlogger Nuts, there's my GoPro, can you see it, can you see it, can you see it? <laughs> oh, yes, another good pen, still got a good amount of ink, halfway full, I'd say. Mmm, what's this? Charm Pendant. Oh, Swarovski. Uh-oh. What do we got? Come on, be in here, please. The last Swarovski box was a book. It was empty. Let's see about this one. Dang. Another bust. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Alright, I'm gonna put that aside. In case we find the Swarovski Pendant. Definitely want to keep the box. It's a slim chance, but there's a chance. Here's how we do it, guys, right here. Give it a little shaky, shaky. Okay, what we got in here? Nothing. Nothing. These zippers feel cheap right here. I'll, I'll say that. You can... Lulu, I don't know that brand. Um, you can tell, usually, how good a, you know, handbag, garment, any item, really, just based on how it's feeling. This one's not feeling so good. <laughs> Candle. Alright, let's go in the flea market. But what we got here? Oh, don't show that. There's her Visa card. Definitely can't show that. But then there's a Starbucks gift card. Oh, please. Oh, it's not scratched off. That could be some money right there. That could be some money right there. Got a fat envelope here, but no money inside. <laughs> Alright guys, but now, what's the important part is the money. We do have some money here. Yep, and I'm going to put that in my pocket. Actually, it's a little dirty. Maybe I'm not going to put it in my pocket. I'll put it over there. While I'm at it, I'll pull out the other change that we found, uh, which I'd already put in my pocket. Okay, now next thing is the wallet. Oh, come on, money. Could be. There's some pennies. Under one sky. Ooh dimes. I don't think this is anything special either. Definitely nicer quality than that, just based on the zipper quality. Um, I'll put it aside, bring home, just so Janet can look at it, but I don't think that'll make our auctions. We really only pull the best, 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 best of stuff out for the auctions, right? Okay. Next up, this one, whoa, this one's like, yeah, that one's not nice. Not a nice quality. Alright, it's empty. Okay. Let's see what this is. A gift card organizer? <laughs> Just kidding. No, it is a receipt organizer, though. And some paperwork. Open me. Oh, this is where the Starbucks card came out of. Right here. Alright. Alright, guys. Let's take a look at this. I can tell you right now, I don't like how it's... Looks like it's cut open. Let's see if it really is cut open. <laughs> I don't want anything that's open. Ah... Uh, Mm, mm That's not a good color. I don't like that color either. I don't what do you I don't think this I don't think this is good. There's only one way to find out. <laughs> I shouldn't do this, I shouldn't do this. Tastes a little chalky. Not bad. It just tastes chalky. Alright, that was enough of that. It wasn't good enough to have another. Alright. What else we got in here? Regalo? What's this? What is this? Oh my goodness, that's kind of cool. That's like a playpen, right? Yeah, it's like a, a portable playpen. I would think it needs a mat to go on the bottom, like a round cushy thing, but maybe not. Alright, let's get this bag here. Bernstein Bears. There's some more kid books here. What's that? Three bucks, whatever it was. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. That's kind of cute, isn't it? Ooh, there's another um, Cat in the Hat book. Baby journal. Let's see if they completed any of it. Oh, they did. Okay, I'll get that back to the owners. There's a decent little Buzz Lightyear right here. That's a nice toy. Dr. Seuss. A little more baby clothes. Oh, my goodness. <gasps> Guys, you will not believe this. Last night, 
last night, Camille's getting ready for bed. I told her, I said, I found a hydro flask in this locker today. Do you want it? And she says, no, but I want, I want a Starbucks cup. And I'm like, like a coffee mug? And she's like, no, I want one of the ones for water with a straw. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. She asked for this. Oh my goodness, I'm going to take a picture right now and text that to her. That is insane. I told her, I said, I will find it, Camille. I find everything in lockers. And look at this, not even, uh, not even 24 hours later, probably 20 hours later, I find it. My goodness. Oh, another dime. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. You got money everywhere in this locker. And actually, the bag itself is pretty dang cool. It's got a jungle theme, and it's made by H&M. That's a decent decent bag right there. I like it. Dexter boot. For the wine rack. That's funny. This guy's got a lot of wine racks. Car wash. That's cool. And uh, an easel. And that's it. A couple more throw pillows. Those are those were loose in there. In other words, those are dirty. I'm just gonna let those go. Oh, piggy bank. Come on. Oh, okay. There's something in there. Not much, but there's something in there. <laughs> yeah, there's a nickel in there. And that's it. Yeah, the stopper's inside of there. Okay, let's see what we got here. Hmm, little pots. Hmm, they're all strung together. Wait, what is this? Oh, this is like a wind chime, I think. Okay, this is kind of neat. Okay, we got some kind of big, huge, sloppy bag right here that's been opened. And, oh wow, look at all those movies underneath. Okay, first up. Fog machine, go in the market. I already got one. And that one looks kind of thrashed. So, next up, Don Perignon box. It's empty. I, I was gonna open it, but nah, let it go. Oh, this one's not empty. But again, I don't think it's uh, got a full bottle. Yep, yep, empty bottle. But glass is adding to the weight. Still not worth anything. Okay. Man, this is just a mess in here. The nice extension cord, or actually there's a couple of nice extension cords in there. And then a not so nice extension cord, but we'll get a few bucks, a few bucks each of those at the flea market. Mm. Um, hmm. That's a basket and looks like it's little eggs in there. It's more for Easter. Can my mom use that for gifts? I don't know. I don't know. This is heavy. Okay, what's in here? Uh, paperwork. Ah, uh, brochures of some sort. Hmm. Alright, that's too bad. Those are not worth anything. A little book bookend. A little more photos. We'll go through that. More business cards. And some magazines. And that's it. Dang it. Alright, there's some sort of a dustbuster that's almost got some life to it. Oh, you know what? We found a char a base charger before. I bet you that's what that might have been for. Ah, dang it. I really want to sell that, but I mean, I want to bring it straight to the market, but now I'm like, uh, it's not worth anything without the base, right? The charger. What's this? Another nice uh, scarf. The last one we found was Burberry. What's this one? Banana Republic. It's decent. Oh my goodness. This is hilarious. This exact same Halloween bucket right here. Exact same as the one that I found in that locker recently. The really good locker. We used it for Halloween. <laughs> now there's a air purifier, I think. Heat setting. Wait a second. That's a heater. Looks super clean, too. Um, that's kind of neat. Actually, maybe I'm going to bring that home and put it in the garage. I don't know. Well, look at this, guys. Look at all of these. Oops. All of these movies. They're in a garbage bag. I'm going to transfer them to this bin right here. What's this right here? This little uh, baby seat. I forget, we used to have one when, when our daughters were little. They called a bumbo or something like that. It almost looks like this, but not quite. All right, I'm going to transfer these. I'll do it off camera because that's not very exciting. Okay, guys, there's what the bin looks like. Bottom is full. That's more than half full. 
There's a lot of DVDs, but it looks like there's some clothes under. Oh, there's some more in there too. Jeez. Okay, but here's some clothes or something. Something. I don't know what it is. There's a charger. Fisher Price. Okay, some baby thing. All right. That's a very nice baby blanket right there. Very nice. And a couple good blankets here. Yeah. All right. I'll, we'll just take those to Stockton. Well, maybe not this one. <laughs> this one says West Elm. Um, and that is a that's nicer. It's made in India. I'm going to put that aside. And the other, the baby blanket wound up being anthropology. So I'm going to put those two to go to the De Anza flea market. And these ones here, these ones can just go to Stockton. Okay. In wall TV power kit. Wait. Oh, wait. That's actually pretty cool. Right? You put it behind your TV so the power's not sticking out. Run your HDMI cable into the wall right there. That's actually kind of nice. Okay. There's another creepy Halloween thing right here. Creepy. <laughs> it does say creepy. Creepy towering clown. Yeah, that looks like that's pretty scary. Stands seven feet tall. Side to side motion with moving mouth. Wow. Okay. That one was 200 bucks brand new. That's crazy. That is crazy. Okay, I'm going to use that bag that we cleared out earlier. Um, and then we're going to put these throw pillows in there. There's a few more throw pillows and they're just thrown in. Okay. Yeah, there's a big teddy bear. He'll go in there too. And then what else we got in here? Oh, this hangs from the roof, right? In the bedroom. Goes over a bed or something. Makes it look like a princess house. I think that's what that is. What else we got in here? Oh, look at this. Got some bubble wrap. Oh, that's nice actually. Got two of them. That's really good. This is saving me money right there. That's the same as making money. Saving money is making money, guys. I say that many times. And that is my one of my mottos. Okay. Bunch of little cups right there. Mm, everything's just costly in here. Okay, we got some fences here for your Halloween display. Man, that is so spooky. It's kind of cool, though. Looks like a skeleton arm right here. There's all kinds of crazy stuff going on. Oh, that looks like a table right here. A little plastic table. Hey, what's this? Oh, that's one too. That's nice. It looks a little short though, but... Oh, what's this? This looks like a uh, Christmas tree right here. And what's this? Decorative deer. Two decorative deers. Accessories not included. What accessories? Hmm. Taped. Okay, yeah, that's actually kind of neat. The resin, but they're, um, they got that faux wood look. Those are, those are cool. I'm going to actually show that to Jana. I think she's going to swing by here at some point. So I think I'm going to put it aside and show her. That way she can make a decision right now. Potential Christmas decoration or flip at the market. Okay, let's see what's in this gigantic green bag. I'm thinking Christmas tree. It feels like a Christmas tree. Hmm, and that's because it's a Christmas tree. And you know what, guys? That actually looks like a pretty decent one. That is a pretty decent looking tree right there. Wow, okay, and it's flocked. Is that what it's called? Flocked? Flocking? This flocked tree? Alright, that's going to Stockton. I would probably be much better just putting it locally for sale, but I just don't have time for that lately. Alright, guys, I gotta give my back a, a break from it. That chest harness, it really starts to hurt your back after a while. Any of you guys that do what I do, um, which is wear a GoPro and film yourself for hours on end, uh, you know what I'm talking about. It does start to hurt after a while. I haven't been here for hours today, but I was here probably six hours yesterday. Um, so there's our skeleton thing. It looks like it sits, I don't know what it does. No, that's an arm, bendable arms, spooky thing. It's pretty funny. I don't know if you hang him. I don't know what you do. Oh, is this a costume? Nah. I don't know what it is. Okay. That's kind of neat. Look at that bag right there. It says Frida. Right? The famous artist. We'll put that aside and go through that after. Okay. There's another extension cord here. Again, easy money at the market. Some decent ornaments there. That's a nice little wreath. Faux foliage on there. Hey, God, is this stuff... They did it. They are... Mmm. I got nothing nice to say about how they packed this, uh, or just threw the stuff in there. Even if they weren't coming back, it's just, I don't know what that is. Some kind of unicorn thing. 
I don't know if it's a, oh, I maybe mean, you know what it is, it's a sleeping bag, that's funny. I know some kid was loving that. Oh, that's a nice throw pillow right there. It's got dirt on it now. It's, it's cool. It's going to top off my uh, duffel bag right here. <laughs> got a big bag of clothes, we'll go through that off camera. Not terribly exciting. This though, <laughs> look at the size of this Minnie Mouse. Her hands are all dirty though. If I can get some of the dirt off, it's not coming off. I know it can clean up, a little bleach wipe, but that's probably an expensive plush right here. The size alone. Disney baby. I don't know, what do you think? Is that a $20 bill? I think that should be at least a $10 bill. We'll see. That's a nice card table right here. It's actually really nice because it's not like all scratched up. Most, most of my tables are pretty scratched up at this point. Uh, but I don't use card tables like this very often because they just, they take up more room than they're worth. But uh, hey, it's good if you have friends coming over playing cards. Well, we're glad to get it out of here because it's super heavy. There's another one of these cups. A couple more things of cups. This will sell. These will sell at the market. Not for much, a couple bucks each. Another Christmas throw pillow. Let's see what this is. Fiesta. I'll see if it's FAO Schwartz or anything. It'll go just in the market. What is this? <gasps> That's creepy. I'll get that out in a second. This thing is a mess right here. It's all jimble. Everything's jimble jambled up. There's a big carpet right here. Oh no, I'm spilling it. <laughs> okay, I just set up one of the wardrobe boxes. Found a bunch of empty boxes in the other unit. So I'm gonna start throwing some of these larger items in there. And I was saying I'm gonna save Halloween stuff. This kind of stuff, I'm just gonna let it go. It takes up too much room. It's too sloppy. This has got a bunch of plush. This is definitely going in the wardrobe box. I gotta go to it first now. It's cute. Let's right, go in wardrobe box. <laughs> wardrobe box. Looks like someone won some nice uh, prizes, maybe at carnivals, maybe. I don't know. That's Peppa Pig right there. I'm gonna put that aside. That's something a little better. That's Wilbur, but he's got some dookie on his face. See that? He's been rolling in his poop. <laughs> Just kidding. I don't know where he's rolling, but he's dirty. This Curious George right here is kind of interesting. This one, not really. Couple more. Couple more. Yeah, this one's mini. This is nice. You could just tell it's got much better quality. This one's going to the side. Okay. And another baby blanket. See some more Christmas ornaments in here. We'll go through that. Okay, I thought this was going to be like a whole doll. It's just this guy right here. I don't know what he's supposed to fit onto, but look how creepy he is. Very realistic face. Oh, he's supposed to hang. Maybe there's a bottom half. Maybe there's not. I don't know. That's a creepy looking doll right there. I don't know what to do with this guy. Man, that's a really creepy looking. Very new gift wrap. Big old Christmas tree here. Decoration, decor thing. See that? It's kind of nice. Another nice throw pillow right there. Jeez. And in here. Ooh, that's a nice blanket. It's got like a faux fur on one side. Oh man, that is a nice one. Really, really nice right there. And it smells clean too. That's rare. Okay, right there, a whole bunch of more garland and stuff. See that? Another throw pillow. Okay. Oh wow. There's a whole nother garbage bag full of plush right here. All right, we'll go through that and see if there's anything good. Little frozen jacket, Disney Frozen. It's nice. What's this? Tommy Hilfiger for little kids, or not like little kid, but looks like seven, eight year old, maybe ten year old. That's nice. Look at that. This is heavy, like it's full of toys. I'm gonna have to put that aside. We'll go through it. This looks like it might be another big tree right here. Okay. There's a nice piece of luggage right here. Very nice. B E I S. Vice? 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 Is that a good brand? It feels like it's a decent quality. It's got a little lock built in right there. That's a nice bag. My girls uh, use bags like these, these hard case ones. Um, maybe they want an upgrade. I don't know. I'll bring it. I'll bring it. <laughs> Alright, guys, let's go through some of this stuff here. Alright, got a little plushy moose. It says a little. Dirt mark on there though. Mm. I'm not sure I'll take that or not. Okay, there's a little jewelry right there. 
Just costume. Just costume. That is a nice bag. I do like that. We'll take that to Danza. This. I don't know what that is. Maybe a back massager? This could be. Postcard. Eyelashes. Brand new card. Okay, here's another ring. Wait a second. This could be silver. Definitely looks like it could be silver. But I don't see a mark. We'll put that aside. We'll check that later with the loop. Yeah, we got a lot of a lot of uh, jewelry in here. Her styler. Some kind of hair. Curling iron or something. Kinder Scott bag right here. Ooh, maybe there's some Kinder Scott. Uh, oh, there's some more. There's some more money. <laughs> I'll take that. Yeah. yeah, that's nice. That looks like some turquoise, and if that's turquoise, that's probably silver. And that definitely feels like silver. I think those are some silver turquoise earrings right there. Nice. That's just a costume piece right there. It's kind of cool though. With a costume piece right here. It appears to be another costume piece right there. Mark Jacobs on that. Um, this all all this will need to be untwisted, sorted out. But I'll do that at home. This piece right here is kind of interesting. There's a locket. It looks like. Yeah, that's a little bit nicer. I wonder if that's the Kendra Scott piece. Doesn't look like a uh, silver. Juicy Couture is what it is. Okay. This little necklace right here. That might be silver. And we got a little blackberry. <laughs> A lot more stuff that needs to get sorted out at home, but again, I don't see anything too special in here. No gold for sure, but I don't see any potential silver here either. Nah, this is a decent amount of costume though. Costume? Alright, that's cool. Alright guys, um, got through a lot of the junky, junky, junky stuff. And uh, we're getting close here. And you know what? I gotta be honest with you. I'm kind of glad. I, I wanna be, I, I'm actually ready to be done with this locker. Uh, I want to be done. I haven't found anything good in a while. But um, clear some of the clothes and stuff out. Look at that. That's kind of neat. Oyster shells. Um, uh, I, I don't know if that's a wind chime or what. It's just decorative. But it's kind of neat. It's kind of neat. I dig it. But yeah, it wasn't stored very well. Pieces of it falling off. Look at this right here. This is nice. Crate and barrel. I just noticed the, the tag. I noticed how nice it was, but I didn't notice the tag. That's a heck of a nice blanket. Dang. Dang. Um, okay, a little bit more ornaments. Ooh, these are nice. These little globes right there. That's cool. Right. Uh, I got this little red stool right here. And a few more throw pillows. A few more fake plants over there. Get these out of the way. This, uh, what do you think? Another Christmas tree. That's what I think. That's what I think. Where's the zipper? The zipper! Oh, here it is. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. That's another nice tree. Nice quality. It's got the lights built in. And, yeah, I don't know how much we get for those in Stockton, but... <laughs> Not bad. Whoa! Oh, that's neat! Look at this! Oh! Little kid's piano. <laughs> a little wobbly, though. That's not going to be terribly expensive. That will sell in Stockton. They love that kind of stuff. Oh, that's what that stool goes to. Okay, that's cool. Um, yeah, I mean, what do we got? I don't know. Plush, Easter eggs, cheap luggage. Uh, let's, let's look in this. This is one of the last, I think, interesting boxes right here. I think it's empty. It's light. It's probably empty. Oh, wait, there is a bin here I want to go through with you guys. Okay. Let's look in here. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Empty. Wow. Whatever it was, there was three of them and they were $245 each. Looks like they got one in black, one in navy blue, and one in red. Dang. A blousens. Blousens? Blousens? Maybe it's women's. I don't know. Wow. It's 735 bucks. Okay, but then this one right here, this was right in there. Well, whatever. I pulled it out and put it over there. Had a bunch of kids' clothes on top. I'm like, let me just go through this offline. Who cares, right? Puma, right there. This, though. Handbags. Wait, okay, wait. Let's go through this first. Let's try to keep it in order. All you need is what it says. All you need. Okay, just a little mini USB. Some San Francisco tour boat. All you need is what this is called. I don't know what that is. Let's see if we, maybe we got some better purses. It looks like that's leather. This doesn't feel that nice. 
Forever 21, okay. Yeah, it's alright. It's okay. Look at this. It's pretty smushed. But this is a leather. Oh, yes. Oh, how funny. I was just talking to Jen on the phone. I said, I haven't found any more Michael Kors purses. <laughs> and then I did. Yeah, that's not bad. It's a little bit dirtier on the... Eh. It's not bad. It's definitely used, but it's not, like, super dirty. I think it just needs to be vacuumed out, really. Little, uh, you know, wear on the leather there, not a big deal. It still s smells... It still smells like leather, like brand new leather. What the heck? How's it have that smell still? So Michael Kors is some good quality stuff. Oh, there's some earrings in there. I wonder if that's any silver. <laughs> Just three. <laughs> that's like every pocket. Alright. Well, okay, that's that's fantastic, guys. That's fantastic. I really wasn't even expecting it to be that good in here. But I was hoping. Victoria's Secret bag. It's, gosh, it's just so smushed. Alright, I'm not going to try to sell that. It's, it's brand new, but it... I mean, I'm sorry. I'm not going to auction that, right? We're not going to auction that. Well, maybe. I don't know. It's just 70 bucks. Alright, I'll put it aside. <laughs> it's just so smushed. Dooney and Burke, what the heck? Okay. Dooney and Burke, very nice. Even nicer than Michael Kors. Dooney and Burke wallet. Okay, guys. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. Victoria's Secret gift card. Oh, it's not scratched off. <laughs> Maybe there's something on there, too. This this story could have a happy ending right at the end. That's a beautiful little wallet. Yes, there's wear on it. No, I don't think it matters. Well, the crease is probably worse, but I think it could be worked out. These Dooney and Bur Burks are made to last, like, forever, though. Really. Okay, stain right there. Yeah, it can be cleaned up, though. It's worth it. There's a Michael Kors. Dust bag right here. Oh, what's this? That's a shoe. That's a little dirty on there, but that can be thrown in the washing machine. Pink. Love pink. That's what it says. Love pink. Yeah, that's what it is. Pink. Pink, 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 pink. Banana Republic. Nice little hat right there. How much was that? Doesn't say. Dang, this is a good little bin. This one says love. Okay, that's that's a cool looking bag though. It's denim. Another pink bag right here. Very nice. Okay, that's a cool. Oh, what do we got here? We got some coins, a few pennies. One of them fell on the ground. H and M right there. Okay, let's see if that's anything special. I don't think it is. What about this? Nope. H and M. Okay. Victoria's Secret make a bag. Wait, this is heavy right here. Why is this so heavy? Okay, we got some stuff in here. First up, we got a Bart ticket. A couple Bart tickets. Five cents. Don't know. That's our mass transit here in the Bay Area, in case you guys didn't know. The Disneyland tickets, and we went to Disneyland. Yeah, I see some pennies in here. What the heck? How is that? Where is that stuff hiding at? Okay, here we go. I think it was in here. Nope. What the heck? The wallet is uh, damaged inside and there's a split and this stuff has fallen into the crevices. That's where the weight was coming from, guys. All that changed in there. Okay, that'll do it. Jessica Simpson wallet. Some extension cord. A little makeup bag. Oh, look at this. More coins. And there's a nickel just chilling right there, just chilling, hanging out, saying, pick me, pick me. Oh, I see some quarters. I see a quarter, at least. There we go. Make it rain. Woo-hoo-hoo! <laughs> All right. A little hat. Oh, the penny. And... Da-da-da-da! What do we got here? Nothing. 
Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, and there's a couple little pennies in here, too. Alright, guys, I'm pretty much done. I, I got a few things to put away, but look at this. That was empty. Yeah. <laughs> empty. Feels good. That's the second one. Over here to the first one. That's a bin of photos. I'm going to put that in last so I can make sure I get it to the uh, facility office before I leave. I don't know what happened over here. It was like just a total mess. It's not my job. I don't know if these tenants did that or maybe someone before did it, but what a, what a gross mess in there. Looks like something exploded. But yeah, I got a few more pieces here to get out. Jenna is going to swing by. I don't think I'll get her on camera because um, I'm just wrapping up. I mean, she pushed it right to the end, but I was hoping she'd go through these plush. Uh, I wanted to make a call on that Disney and uh, a couple of these other decorative pieces. Like, do we take those home or do we just blow them out? But anyways, uh, good good couple in here. It's not that good, but it was, it was all right. They... Like I said at the end of the last one, I bought the right units, meaning these people had money, and that's what we're always aiming for, we're shooting for, to find a good locker with some good stuff. These people uh, fit the bill in as far as spent the money, but they didn't store it in here. We found all those Louis Vuitton boxes, no Louis Vuitton's. This is where they put their overflow, and also I really do think they came in here, the last time they came in here, they came with the intent to not come back, and they went through this and just ripped it all apart and pulled out what they were looking for. They didn't pull the Michael Kors purses, thankfully. Those are probably the best things we found. Dooney and Burke wallet. But we found a lot of stuff. The, the Blu-ray DVDs we'll make some money on. I, mean, I don't know. With fees, we're over 800 bucks into this thing. I'll make money on it. There's so much flea market inventory and it's good stuff. We'll do it, but this is not going to be like a home run, thousands and thousands of profit. And we're going to have to grind this one out. So, um, eh, whatever. It, it is a numbers game, but I seem to be on a streak of not so good lockers. I know I get a lot of comments from people saying, wow, you get so lucky you're on a good streak. Maybe we were for a while there, but we certainly aren't anymore. This is the reality of storage lockers. They're mostly like these, uh, where people go through and they, they leave the garbage behind, knowing they're going to stick the facility in the facility, of course. Not intentionally, but they stick it on us because we're the ones bidding on it. So it is the reality, and uh, it is part of the business. So no complaints. We're going to keep doing it, but... Um, I'm happy with these lockers. They're not bad. They're not terrible. We've had much worse. At least they were clean people with expensive tastes. So with that, <laughs> Jam is calling me, I think. Yep. All right, guys. Until next time, good luck to you. God bless you. We'll see you next time here on All Aganuts. All right, good morning, Locker Nuts, and I should also say happy Thanksgiving because today is Thanksgiving. Where am I going? I'm going to the flea market. I'm sure you know that from the thumbnail, but there is a flea market today. Stockton, California, a place we've been to many times, but we've never been there on Thanksgiving. Today is Thursday. It's just about 5 a.m.